Hey everyone, Brian and Jeff with Workshop Addict and today we're going to take a look at the Skill Saw 12 inch dry cut saw model number SPT62MTC and this comes with a Diablo Steel Demon Sermit 2 carbide blade. It has a 15 amp motor and the blade speed is at 1500 RPM. This blade itself actually has a max speed of 1800 RPM, mild steel. It's got a depth of cut of uh, four and a half inches and on the flat it'll cut about six and a quarter. Beautiful cast aluminum base, sturdy vise or miter, whatever you want to call it because it does cut 45s, cuts angles. Nice extendable table, gives you a little extra working space. I really think that they designed this a little bit more for safety. A lot of the abrasive saws that you'll see out there don't have a safety switch up top. You have an ambidextrous safety. You have a full cover blade guard on the side. And then you have a nice catch back here for the chips with mm -hmm. a chip tray. So, and there's also a shield for your eyes here. They seem like they, you know, they put a little bit more safety into this one than you might see on some other models. This is really designated for steel work. Safety and accuracy, if I had to put two things on this, and, and then if, when you get into actually cutting with it, when you compare this to an abrasive saw, there is no fireworks, as I will call it. I mean, it just cuts through. You might see a couple small sparks, but this thing is, is about cutting, cutting fast, and cutting accurately. And hands down, by far the best saw I've ever used for this application. I mean, we're talking about good power and um, fast, accurate cuts. Yeah. I can't believe how fast it cuts. I think that has a lot to do with the blade. You're getting away from abrasives. You're getting into a nice, cool, clean cut with mm -hmm. the Diablo blade. And the blade is set up for, or it says, max of quarter inch. And we were cutting some quarter inch angling with it. Mm -hmm. Not a problem at all. No, and when you get into like a threaded rod or a round tube, they give a, a max of one inch on that. So we pushed it to what we could and we were impressed. I mean, it was, it was something that you're not sitting with an abrasive uh, blade just kind of waiting for it to get through. This thing cut through, it cut through quick. And even the 45, when we adjusted it, you know, a lot of people always say, hey, why can't we get a metal saw that adjusts like the wood miter boxes? And this, this one, one does. It, it does. It still leaves you a little bit of precision. You know, you have the, the markings are, what, a 16 inch wide. So if you yeah. need to get precise, you still got to get out your um, angle Quick. finder and make it work. But at the same point, we were able to do some excellent cuts with this with great accuracy. And, and very little cleanup on your cut. I mean, if you're welding angles together, very little cleanup. Very nice, straight, clean cut. No, and, and I like how they made this base, cast into it. You got the nice extension on the side. Everything's all set up out here. Very sturdy. Awesome unit with carry handles built into it in the front and on the top. If you're looking for something for the job site, for your workshop, if you're cutting any kind of metal like this, this is really gonna speed things up, cool things off as far as the cuts, and give you a lot more accuracy. I mean, it was cool. Yeah. I enjoyed it. I love this saw. So stop by Workshop Bags. We've got a blog and a forum over there. We'll have more information on this skill saw. And also give us a like and subscribe to our channel. We go over all kinds of cool tools like this. We have projects, we have different tool news, and we have a lot of giveaways. Stop by our social media. Check us out there. We got this stuff going on a little bit before it hits YouTube. Thanks for your time, guys. Have a great day.